Rogic. It's a good cross, it's a chance, it's a goal! Yeah! Anthony Ralston for Celtic in the 97th minute! Anthony, a trip to Dingwall up next in the Scottish Premiership. You were the hero there back in December. Take us back to that moment when you scored that last minute header that gave Celtic all three points. Yeah, it was um, it was a bit mental, to say the least. Uh, obviously, I've, I remember it well and it will live with me forever, you know, that moment. Um, probably something I might never do again, but, um, you know, it was the main thing was obviously that we got the three points, um, which is obviously difficult to do and, and when you come away to these places. Um, but obviously, on a personal note, it was, um, it was a bit of a dream. You score a late winner and, and you've seen how all the, the travelling fans reacted and things at the time. And So, no, it was good. I, I've got great memories of it. Was that a moment as a Celtic fan growing up that you personally dreamt of to score a last minute winner to get Celtic over the line in such a tough game? Yeah, you know, it's uh, it's obviously something especially growing up that you always you've either watched yourself and you you know, you think, Oh I wish that you know, that could be me one day, you know. So for sure and you know, and you never expect it to happen, you know, it's just the, the you know, the ball. Um, Tom's hung up a great cross and I found myself in the position and was able to just put it in, you know, and, um, and it, was, it was quite it was carnage after that, but um, again, great memories that will love me forever. Just talking about the season overall, it's been a really big season for you, personal growth, five goals, seven assists, that's a brilliant return and a contribution you must be delighted with, Anthony. Yeah, for sure, you know, it's... Um, I've obviously I've spoke about you know, last season it wasn't you know the easiest of times um, here, um, but you know we come in this season and be given an opportunity and to have so far you know taken it and uh, I'm delighted with how the season's been on a personal note uh, for myself and um, you know it's just important that I continue that not just to the end of the season but also into next season and you know the seasons to come and it's important the consistency stays but I'm delighted how the seasons went. I've worked really hard to get myself um, in this position and. I just need to continue working hard and hopefully it'll take care of itself moving forward as well. You're competing with Josip Juranovic for that right back position at the minute. Is that something that you personally thrive on, that level of competition? Yeah, it's important that, you know, in all areas and all positions that you have competition, um, me and Jura have, um, you know, we support each other in every way. You know, when, when Jura's playing, I support him to the max and he does the same with me. We've got a great um, relationship as well, um, so it's important and it pushes each 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 other on, you know, um, to to keep pushing yourself in training to play. You know, we all want to play, um, and it's it's really important that we have that in the team. We do have that in a healthy way. Obviously, there was disappointment last weekend, Anthony. But is it important to have that perspective that the captain was speaking about, and now to really focus on the game at the weekend and hopefully make this a memorable season after all? Yeah, you know, we're extremely disappointed. Um, uh, everyone is in, as a team um, on on last week, but you know it's done now, and it's important that we focus on the next game, which is Sunday. And it's an important game, um, as well as the next, you know, the four after that are as well. So um, but that's our focus now. Um, it's done. We, we put it to bed, and we we focus now on the upcoming game, and, and that's what we're all doing.